Hello, my name is Mark Blocker. In this segment, we're going to cover how to cope inside molding. Inside coping is a term that describes an alternative to inside 45 cuts made for making the inside corners on molding. Um, and basically what that does is, is you've got a corner joint, instead of making two 45 inside cuts joined together and make a 90 degree angle on your inside corner, you have one piece that's just butt cut on a 90 and the other piece butts up against it with the use of coping. How we uh, achieve this, really easy, first on your inside piece make a cut of 45 degrees and what you see of material there, that 45 degree cut, that's what has to be removed for the cope to work correctly. The next thing we're going to make a cut with our chop saw, cut out the meat section of the actual material and then this upper lip here is what you're going to use your coping saw to cut off. That's how I got the name cope molding and that can just be done by holding it down on a table or other flat surface using your coping saw. And what we're going to end up with on our final piece is that 45 cut with all the excess material hanging off. Just follow your blade line that your chop saw makes on your 45 line, butting up one piece in the corner, the other piece butting to it. As you can see, it makes a real tight, easy joint regardless whether you have to open or close the angles in the corner. That's how you cope inside molding.